Hi everybody. Uh, hope you are all doing well. And here we are on our fifth week of um, our journaling through Psalm 23. Um, today's reflection is from verse five. And verse five says, you prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil and my cup overflows. So I thought a lot about this and having um, it just have been Mother's Day, I guess probably a, a, several as I hope, you know, despite the quarantining or maybe you couldn't do it, but um, you know how our families come together at times like this and sit around the table. And that might just be friends, doesn't necessarily have to be, you know, blood relatives, you could be away or maybe in a nursing home and it's all your friends in the nursing home and maybe people even called or maybe you set up a place for somebody and zoomed them in to your place at the table. But um, I know sometimes it can be a little hard when families get together and um, this week we are talking about, and the pastor's talking about reconciliation and coming to the table for reconciliation. Um, so two things. The reconciliation, I think, is wonderful in talking about getting together at the table. And the other um, part of this verse that really got to me was um, anointing my head with oil. Um, so I went in and took off the label, if you want to see, to the oil, <laughs> the olive oil in my kitchen. So... Um, you can even use things that are in your kitchen to uh, keep journaling through. But um, I thought a lot about that, about olive oil and how it um, was used as a healing property uh, back in the time of Jesus and anointing as well. Um, but just thought that was interesting that you could still just go into your kitchen, even if maybe you have ventured out and in, in, into the world and maybe you've even bought some things to journal with. Um, anyway, thought that was interesting and useful. Uh, so I hope you are all doing well. I hope that you are really getting into your journaling and thinking about each one of these verses in Psalm 23. Um, I can't wait to see your journals. I hope we're going to be able to post some of these and if you take some pictures of them so I can see what everybody's doing. Um, and I really hope all of you are well. So God bless you and make it a great day. And um, I will see you next week for week six and uh, our last week. So we will complete our journals and um, it'd be interesting to hear maybe some of your stories too on um, how this might have helped or help you memorize the verse, the Psalm 23, or if you did it as a family, um, I'd love to hear it. So have a great night and I will talk to you soon.